Christine is homeless and hungry, then Janitor brings him to her secret closet. If you're like me and go to sleep every night in a warm, safe home, with food in the cupboards, you're fortunate. It's easy to look around and see people who have more than us, but we should also remember that people also have less, and many of those people aren't responsible for the situation they're in. This is especially true for children and teens, who have little control over their circumstances, good or bad. According to CovenantHouse.org, around 40% of all homeless people in the United States are under the age of 18. This is a staggering statistic, but fortunately, there are people out there trying to help children and teens who are in this unfortunate situation, making a difference. One of the people out there making a difference is Carolyn Collins, a custodian at Tucker High School. She has something called the Care Closet. Using mostly her own money, Carolyn stocks an extra closet at school with a variety of supplies to give to homeless students who need them. She began collecting and distributing these items three years ago. Two homeless students told her they had nowhere to go and needed help. This was around the same time that she lost her own son to a home invasion. Carolyn shares how this tragic event helped to inspire the care closet. I'm just trying to stop our young boys from stealing and killing, she says. Because they're homeless and they're crying out for help and love. And I'm trying to give them all they need in this closet so, they don't have to go out and try and steal and take from no one. She depends on the teachers at the school to help and let her know when a student is in need of assistance. I tell the teachers a lot, if you see a child always with their head down, with the same clothes on repeatedly, day after day, you know, let me know, chance for a better life. Though she can only do so much, Carolyn is helping these students with basic necessities and giving them a chance for a better future. Homeless students struggle in school and have less chance for success later in life. Her help and kindness may help some of these students out of the cycle of homelessness. We think that Carolyn deserves recognition for what she does to help her community. Hopefully, Carolyn's kindness will inspire others to start similar programs or to help out in their own hometowns. Please share this heart-touching story with your friends and family and subscribe our channel for more.